mistake. You really need to stop looking like me. Well, I do a better you than you do. Show me the real raven, please. Now that's the real raven. Hello and welcome to a Smurpy video and today I am looking at Marvel's Mystique from the X-Men in this lovely packaging. Top the usual X-Men side sign. At the side we have an awesome picture of Mystique posing. You will not mess with me. On the back there are no figures because there are no other figures in this line because it's an exclusive. And here is not a promo shot, it is a drawing. So that's new, that's kind of cool. Dig that. And an expert of duplication and duplicity, Mystique uses power of shape sifting in to assume others' identities and complete covert missions. And also betray everyone that trust her, which they don't anymore. So this figure seemed to sell quicker than hot sauce, but I managed to snag one from Kapow Toy, so thank you very much. And also before I begin, shout out to Gareth Bray. If you're actually watching this dude, um, good guy that I work with, and he actually pointed out about skulls, the, how they usually get bigger, and then if I don't drop it, there's a bigger one in the middle. So um, I didn't notice, to be honest with you, but um, yeah, that's a bit of a letdown. But I guess it's easier than make to make it like this rather than try and do a bigger one in the middle i guess so in terms of the figure she is very very beautiful i am very very happy and this this figure has been a very long time coming so nice facial expression nice skull underneath the red hair the blue obviously body parts exposed and she has this nice little dress that goes all the way down and I I was thinking about this the other day I dig that this is a separate part because if it's not you could find yourself with a mystique very limited in what she can do and the mystique that most people follow she can be a hand-to-hand -hand fighter and do all sorts of crazy stuff so very very cool she is a very very nice figure very happy. i would say the only real letdown from this figure is probably the weapons now i'm not gonna make a big deal of this but she's got a nice rocket launcher here or sniper rifle whatever you want to call it and a pistol pistol you would expect her to have but i do not understand why it is but i want to say gold um, I almost said black then because that's the color I expect it to at least be it's like the nerf guns We got a few years back from uh, X-Force Deadpool. It's like what on earth are you giving us here? It's like they've just said right. Let's cut the budget on painting the guns black and just have them come out as they do and just give it to them So um, it looks nice and I you know, I guess it gives an opportunity to those that are really good at painting to paint them the way that they want them but yeah, a little bit disappointed. But um, other than that, they're, they're nice. Now, this bit I find genius. So we have a Mystique changing into a uh, part Rogue uh, head. Or is it Rogue that she's just absorbed Mystique personnel, I guess is the word that I'm looking for. Um, I'll show her this both on the Mystique figure and on the Rogue figure. Now, if you watched my Silver Sabre um, video the other day, you would have heard me griping about the Lelandra head. So I will put this on the Silver Sabre body, but I still believe that this figure deserves its own body and a, an accurate um, Lelandra with the blue cape and a staff as well. Even if it's Neymar's painted silver, that would do me to be fair but um definitely she deserves her own body and here is the mystique with the rogue head on and it actually looks really really cool and it seems to fit really really nicely and look like it should be there so kudos hasbro for that one very cool well thought off gimmick just for us fans okay and here is the mystique rogue head on the rogue body now if you wanted to do, I guess, a scene, you would get the ungloved hand and you'd perhaps have her 
touch of mystique for that whole sense of, hey, I'm turning into you. Oh my goodness, your memories. Uh, yeah. Okay, moving on. <laughs> so I think it fits nice on there. In fact, I actually really think it's cool. Um, now, I've seen some, some great guys on the Marvel Legends UK group that have had a spare rogue body. Okay, so here is Lalandra. And to me, <laughs> I think I said this before I even got to review her, is it feels odd. It absolutely feels odd. She should have a cloak. She should have a staff. Even if she's being a rebellion, Lalandra without those things. Um, it's okay. It's not brilliant. Um, for customizers, I, I suspect that they could do something wonderful. Take this body, take this head, and make a brilliant figure. Me, I'm not talented in that way. So <laughs> uh, it's very difficult. Very quite frustrating. So I hope we get a little Landra figure at some point. It's a nice little touch, a nice fault. Uh, we deserve a real figure. So come on, Hasbro, give us a figure. We will buy. We will buy a whole Shi'ar team. You know, um, there's plenty of figures in that team that I would love to see, such as Fang, Oracle. Uh, I'm trying to think, is it Mandroid, the, the big robot with the little robot in? You know, I, I would dig all that stuff in. I would buy it because, well, I'm a collector at the end of the day. That's what I do. And here are all three of them together, and they look very, very cool. Like I said, it's not perfect but it's nice and a nice little touch but um overall i hope we get another lalandra figure i hope we get a classic rogue figure uh one thing that would have been nice for the mystique figure would to be have extra hands you know it, there are so many hands out there for the female figures in this line i suspect it's really easy for them to do so it's sometimes a little bit disappointing that we don't get these things, even though we desperately want it. Uh, it's a quick win for Hasbro. Okay, so here she is with the Mystique we got with the Sentinel figure, um, which at the time was quite a cool figure. Uh, clearly this surpasses uh, Toy Biz one. Although I've got to admit the skulls, even though they're not detailed, the kind of color looks pretty cool um but yeah clearly uh, this one is um not standing up to the time i guess you know the face now that i look at the face the face looks kind of weird did anyone ever watch doctor who and you had those big um monsters this what are they called the sliverine or and and they kind of fight and they kind of you know that's that face there that. Here she is with the Brotherhood. You got the Blob and Pyro. I never got that avalanche from the classic line. He, whenever I wanted to get him, he seemed to be going for a silly price. So um, I skipped him and I thought, hey, I'm not even going to bother anymore. And at this point, um, I suspect Hasbro will probably give us a new Blob in the next few years and we'll get a new Pyro and hopefully we get a Destiny this time around and an avalanche to go with this mystique because that would be a great move i hope you're listening hasbro give us the brotherhood of evil mutants because the days of future past is such a classic tale that most x fans want to achieve that complete kind of scene where they're fighting etc for the future and just because she was with x factor for a period here she is where polaris have it Forge and Sabretooth. I'm pretty sure she had a chip in her brain that would make her explode. We need to read that X Factor run. I, I read the beginning of the X Factor run where Havoc, Strong Guy, etc. But then I, you know, I never read the rest. I should do at some point. So Mystique is very cool. I am very happy to have this figure. And um, other than the minor little bits, it's a great upgrade that Hasbro have given us. So, you know, what more do you want? And a great exclusive. Um, although she's hard over here in the UK to get, I'm pretty sure in the US she's probably a bit easier. So, like my Facebook page, Smurd P. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell me if you got this figure. Tell me if you're getting this figure. What you think of Lilandra. 
and the extra road kit and embrace the geekiness. Take care. Goodbye. <laughs>